Hi guys, Karen here with another unboxing and review. And this time is with Le Creuset. I purchased the Le Creuset um, Signature Round Stew Pot. Um, it serves two to four persons. It is um, eight and three fourths inches in diameter. Um, I actually was, um, I, I received a email um, from Le Creuset of items that were being discontinued um, uh, in different stores. Um, this was not an item that I had on my list to purchase this year. Um, as I stated before in previous videos, I am going through my kitchen and replacing things over time, but this is an item that I went ahead and purchased because of the uh, significant discount. So, um, uh, and, it, and the stew pot was not something that I was adding to my, uh, adding to the group of things that I wanted to replace, but, I mean, or that I wanted to add, but, um, but because of the price, like I said, I went ahead and purchased it. So, um, Le Creuset is discontinuing the, the Le Creuset French oven, which is also termed the Colette. They still on their website, they have the, uh, the one Colette that they have the smaller ones, the little tiny, um, individual, uh, cookeries or cook pots, um, or casserole dishes. They're smaller and they come in a set of four, or you can buy them in a set of four. Um, and then they have a decorative one. But other than that, I did not see um, this pot on their site. Um, also, this, um, this is the Signature Round Stew Pot. I've, I've never seen it before, although I was looking for was a smaller brazier that would serve two to, to four people or two to three people, just in case our kids weren't home and had other things to do. That way, if I was cooking, I could cook enough just for two people rather than four or five or six for that matter. Um, so this, um, so this is actual what it is. This is the, um, signature round stew pot. Um, and what it was in the email, uh, it stated it had a little list of the things that were being discontinued. Like I said, it wasn't called the stew pot because of the significant discount. I wasn't sure that it was legitimate or whatnot. So, um, on the picture of the item, this one you wouldn't purchase through Le Creuset. I had to purchase it through Williams and Sonoma. They're the ones who actually had the item at their store. And because we have one close to our area, I was able to schedule to go and see it and pick it up. Um, this item, the Le Creuset stew pot, signature round stew pot, um, normally is $250. Similar to the Le Creuset brazier that uh, serves two to three or four people, that also is $250. That's what I actually had on my list was a smaller brazier to purchase. But when I saw this item, I actually went ahead and got it because it's a little, it's a, to me, it looks like a, uh, a cross between a, a smaller, Dutch oven and a higher raised brazier, just a little bit on the size, which was cool because you know it's like the best of both worlds. However, the so the stew pot was like I said, two hundred fifty dollars. It was on sale for one hundred and twenty nine. So I thought, is something wrong with it or whatnot? But when she told me they were discontinuing it because it doesn't, it wasn't selling as fast as the other items, and that. Um, until it's sold out, you'll probably only be able to purchase it online or you might be able to find it in a local, one of the stores that carry Le Creuset. You would just have to see if your store is on, on the list of, when you click down, it'll say, uh, check stores in your area and they might have it there. Otherwise you will order it online until, like she said, until it's sold out because they're generally coming from stores because it's been discontinued. So the color that I purchased was nectar. Um, and as I said, it's eight and three fourths inches in diameter. Um, 
it serves two to three or four people and um, it's to me it's a cross between a small Dutch oven and a, uh, a, a brazier with raised just slightly raised sides so I'll show it to you so in the color nectar so here it is I just picked I went to pick it up today I um, made an appointment to go pick it up today and it's it's what I was actually looking for, although I was willing to buy the brazier, but hey, who's <laughs> if I don't have to spend $250 for it and I could get it for $129, I'll take the $129 and take the cross between the Dutch oven. And the reason why I say that it's a cross between the Dutch oven and the brazier, because the brazier is just a little bit lower, probably about right here. The Dutch oven, of course, comes up high, but... Um, this one has the kind of like a bowl effect. So it's holding everything in and you can just cook everything in there. Once again, it has the enamel coating. The handles have been molded to the, uh, the pot itself. Um, you still use your rubber, wood, uh, spatulas. It's still dishwasher safe, but I don't put any of my pots or Le Creuset items in the dishwasher, we wash them by hand. Um, and what else? Um, you clean it the same way, it's the same process for everything else. Still in the same warranty, um, even though it was purchased, because that's another thing, even though I purchased it with Williams and Sonoma, Williams and Sonoma is a um, Le Creuset approved store. So if I have any issues, problems, or concerns, I can call Le Creuset about this item because it, it only if it the the sales associate said only if it came from a um outlet but this is not an outlet purchase um but this is a discontinued item though but um well worth it i think if it is you well it's worth it for me for what i will be using it for um none of my items match on purpose because i like all of the colorful items I like a colorful kitchen, a happy kitchen. That doesn't mean if everybody, if you, if you have like we say that matches, it's not happy. I just like uh, different colors. It, it just, I just like that. Um, and uh, yeah, so this is my find, one twenty nine. Um, I hope when I post this video that the sale is still going on for any of you who are looking for the Le Creuset stew pot or something similar to this. Um, because yeah, I think it was a savings for me of, yeah, it was a savings over a hundred dollars. So, um, definitely, um, it's not the brazier that I was actually looking to purchase, but this will do. It's similar to the brazier. I can, I can work with it, but, um, um, yeah, I think that's all I have. Okay. So thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing and review. I hope you all have a fabulous day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.